Good afternoon, Rocky Mount Church family and friends. During the coronavirus crisis and the need to social distance ourselves from each other, thankfully, we can use social media and technology to help us stay connected to one another, engaged in worship, and fulfill our giving online securely. We will post a message from Pastor McKinney later for tomorrow's sermon. After you say amen, please go visit our church website or Facebook page for the link to give. The website address is www.rockymountbaptistchurch.org. That's rockymountbaptistchurch.org to worship through giving of your tithes and your offerings. Here's a quick tutorial on just how easy this process is. Okay, so we're looking at our web page right now. <clears throat> and you see in the upper right hand corner, there is a pay now button and it says pay your tithes and contribute donations by using below button. You will be redirected to a secure payment site. So right now we're going to click on that. We're being redirected. And here is our payment um, secure site. It just says Rocky Mount Baptist Church. Excuse me. It says Rocky Mount Baptist, Talladega, Alabama at the top. So you know you're at the right one. Um, please enter the amount you wish to pay. So you go ahead and put in the amount. I'm putting in a fake amount because I've already done this for today. And you hit submit. So when you hit submit, it brings you to this payment portal where you will put in your name, your credit card number, your address, the credit card or debit card expiration date. And please note here that it is a four digit only format, which means no dashes, no slashes. So only put in numbers here. So, and then after that, we go to your city. Uh, to the three or four digit code that is on the back of your card goes here Then you put in your state which is probably going to already be populated to Alabama uh, Then put in your zip code your email address and then um, It says a confirmation email will be sent to this address meaning it will send you a confirmation letting you know that the payment has been received and then for verification, you have to click the reCAPTCHA uh, square that says, I am not a robot. So you click that and then hit pay with your credit card. So again, quickly, we're going to type in your name. I'm just going to type in my name and I'm going to put in a fake credit card. Okay, then I'm going to tab down and then it's going to ask for my address, putting in a fake address. Street. And then it's asking for my expiration date on my card. I'm just going to put in a fake expiration date. And then it's asking for my city. We're just going to put in any town. And then it's asking for my security code, which would be three numbers. I'm just putting in that. And my state is already selected. And I put in my zip code 351, you know, 60, Talladega. And I am going to put in, add my email address, but I'm going to let it auto do that. So I don't have to type that out. And now for the verification, I'm just going to click in here that I'm not a robot. And then pay with credit card. We will pretend like I clicked that, but because the other information is incorrect, I know it's going to come back declined and not valid. So anyway, that is how you do it. And once you hit pay with credit card, it's going to actually redirect you back to our church's website. And it may say that going from the secure site back to the website is not secure, but it's OK. Go ahead and click OK so you can get back here. Now, remember, um, we're going to start posting um, the sermons on our website as well as Facebook. So start looking for those either late this evening or early tomorrow morning. And then the next week, we should start also with our Sunday school lessons. 
each teacher will take a Sunday and teach from their book, no matter what age level it is. And if it's not your age level, don't skip it just because it's not your age level. Listen to them anyway. Uh, send them some comments. Uh, ask questions. Say amen. You could do that. It won't be a live post, but you can comment on Facebook to let them know that you were there and that you did listen to it. Okay. So while we're going through this crisis, we want to always keep our focus on Christ and not um, minimize, excuse me, we want to minimize um, our interruption or the interruption of this COVID-19 as much as possible. So stay safe, stay six feet apart, uh, but continue to worship God uh, through you know, listening to the lessons, listen to the sermons and giving online. And if by chance uh, you absolutely feel like you cannot um, do the online payment portal, I will post the PO, the church's PO box on Facebook. So you can send a check, not cash, uh, to the PO box and our treasure will take care of recording that for you as well. So have a blessed day. Be safe and God bless. Love you all. Bye-bye.